So now I'm going to take off the cap, stride, and all you do is just go on here and pull it off. get all the plastic out of here. That's how it looks in the inside. I hope you can see that. And what I'm going to do now is put it on my mannequin so I can cut it. Hair pins in place so I know where I want to cut and what I want to keep the same. So. That's what's going on. I'm going to straighten up the hair and I'm going to come right back to you. So this is what I've done so far. I'm going to put my lighting up in here. I just made a straight cut across because I'm doing a bob. And what I'm going to do next is take it and go down in the line so it can flow into the other side. So if you get what I'm saying. So it's hard for me to capture it on camera, I do apologize, but um, I'll come back with you guys and let you know how it's all going. Alright, this is what I have so far uncurled, so I'm going to curl my bangs. And I actually like it, I did a pretty good job. You know, I did a pretty good job, I think. What do you guys think? That's what matters, what you guys think. But I'm going to take you through a tour, and I will have my final product shown on the next one. So here we go. Ooh. Work. I'm already talking myself, but hey, hope you guys like it. All I did in the back was when I put it on the mannequin, I had, well actually before that, I put it on my head and actually figured out where I wanted to, my bob to be the shortest at in the back. And then I clipped it with one of these. And then I took the scissors and went straight across, slowly though, so it won't look choppy. And then after that, I took like a row or three rows, you know, or just a good amount of hair at one time. I took a good amount of hair at one time and then I just held the hair in my hand and I took the scissors and did like this across the hair. Just like. So, hopefully that was a good demonstration or understanding of how I did that part. But it was a... Um, I did that all the way to the top so I can try to get some volume back here. And then on the side I just try to go at an angle for that sharp look. But I mean, I like it so far. So that's kind of what I was going for anyway. And um, when I did my bang, I figured out where I like it to stop normally and I just snippet it and then started trying to started going down with my scissors slightly. Um and I did use my razor comb a little bit to um like give it thin it out a little bit because it's a little thick in places. And then um that's all I really did. I'm sorry I couldn't show you guys but there are some videos out there that show you how to like do it Bob. This is my interpretation of Retro Bob. So I hope you guys liked it, enjoyed it. Um, I will show some pictures of how it looks with it curled. And don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, please. It means a lot to me. And if you have any requests, let me know. But anyway, I hope y'all have a good weekend. Peace.